So with the Snyder Cut being released next year on HBO Max, up till this point, we really didn't know how much footage was going to be used from the Josh Whedon cut of the movie. Up until now, Zack Snyder has made it clear on exactly how much footage he's going to be using. In a recent Q&A session, when asked on how much footage Zack Snyder was going to actually use of the Josh Whedon cut, he actually responded, I would destroy the movie that I didn't photograph. That's a effing hard fact. I would blow the effing thing up. Now that is really some harsh words coming from Zack Snyder. Now there are different reasons why Zack Snyder could not be using the Josh Whedon's footage, but this is going to be Zack Snyder's vision. It's gonna be, that's why it's going to be called the Snyder Cut. It's all his footage and nothing more. So, to put some of Josh Whedon's rewrites and reshoots in there, then they would not really make the Zack Snyder vision like he wanted to. We do know that there are 80% of the Snyder Cut that was actually done. And 30% of Josh Whedon's footage was used for the movie. So, we don't really know what 30% was used. We do know that the opening with that horrible Superman mustache scene was used and how that made it into the movie to this day I will never know and if Zack Snyder would have to use any of Josh Whedon's footage then he would have to credit Josh Whedon which is something he doesn't want because he's trying to distance himself it seems like from Josh Whedon's cut especially since everyone's been very outspoken against Josh Whedon uh, all the actors are pretty much against him, saying about how they were mistreated, misused, and that Josh Whedon was just horrible on set. And Zack Snyder has been giving his full support on the actors and just want to completely distance himself from that movie. So there are a lot of footage that didn't make the movie, like Dark Side is definitely going to be in the movie. You got Lex Luthor. I heard that there's a few scenes from him that's going to make it into the movie. Uh, and Deathstroke, I don't think he's going to make it in the movie, but I think he they're going to mention him somewhat. And there's even a rumor that Batman actually helps Lex Luthor escape Arkham Asylum pretty much to make a deal with him since Lex Luthor has that connection to Darkseid and that would be the only way they can help to defeat him is to help get the help from Lex Luthor. Now Zack Snyder has released a footage and so it's been confirmed that the black suit of Superman will make it into the movie and as it appears what the rumor is that is when he comes back Darkseid will be controlling him so he will be under Darkseid's control for the majority of the movie until the end when he snaps out of it then he will be wearing his blue and red outfit again to help the Justice League. So yeah, what are your thoughts on the Zack Snyder cut not using any of Josh Whedon's footage? I would love to hear your thoughts on this. Thanks for watching.